Tonight I'm fishing on a jetty. Now, I've got this contraption right here. Have a look at this. When I saw this, I went, wow. I do a lot of mulloway fishing, especially late at night. And sometimes it's land bay, sometimes it's in the boat, but tonight we're fishing on a jetty. Now, this rod holder is made for a jetty, or for the beach, or the bank. Now, basically, it's got a little contraption down here. Let me just flip this up. We've got, we've got a couple of them here tonight. We've got a few of them here tonight. Basically, if you see that, that goes through the slot of the jetty. You turn it, pull it up, and then tighten the wing nut here. And that keeps it in place. Okay? And if you're not fishing on the jetty, you can slide that straight out. And it just spikes into the bank. But because tonight we're on the jetty, this whole contraption is together as one. And, and also, up here, this extends out, so you can make it even higher. And this is where the rod sits, and that can go up or down. Now, if you follow me over here, you'll see I've already got one done. All set up, ready to go. Got the bait teaser on it. And that's how it sits in the jetty. Now, these are an absolutely fantastic contraption, and I can tell you where you can get it, because I know people are going to ask. I got it from Melbourne Marine Centre in Hallam. Um, they've got all sorts of contraptions in there for fishing. Lures, rod holders, things like this. These are in there and they're only about 30 bucks, so they're absolutely fantastic in value. So if you want a good land-based rod holder, best you get down there and grab one.